faced Victoria for the first time this season over the weekend in a doubleheader down south. After winning 5-4 in the opening game Friday, the Cats got off to a great start Saturday. Local product Raymond Graywall getting his first goal in the Western Hockey League. Graywall does a great job of sneaking in from the point to make it a 1-0 game for the visitors. Tied at 1 now, midway through the second period. It's Alex Gogolev converting on the partial 3-on-1. He puts his team ahead 2-1. That's how it would stand after 20 minutes of play. Middle stands on out. Colin Jacobs with the steal right out front of the Victoria net, but he can't put it past the goaltender Patrick Povica. Halfway through the period, Mark McNulty puts a shot on net. The rebound comes out to Jared Fontaine, and he'll bang it in time the game of two after 40 minutes of play. Third period, the Cougars come up with another glorious opportunity. Dalton Seawalk gets a chance. The rebound just bounces a little bit on him. Paul Vika then makes the save and keeps it a tie game. Then with under three minutes to go, the Cats can't clear. It comes to Brett Cote at the point. He'll find Twine from the blue line. That would be the winning goal. As yes, the Royals do earn the split with the Cougars. Final score 3-2 on Saturday night. So two points out of four for the Cougars in Victoria over the weekend. Just to recap of the scores again, 3-2 and 5-4 over the weekend. The Cats won't have to wait that long to try and get revenge on the Royals. They will play them two more times this weekend, Friday and Saturday at CN Centre.